wine for rainy day. Um, and there are plenty of rainy days up ahead. The idea of this segment is to find you something to pick you up, make it all worthwhile. Um, and I found this wine on Wednesday when it was the base ingredient for Rosie's lentil shepherd's pie. Thank you for making that, Rosie. It was lovely. Um, no thanks for using this wine. It's far too good. Uh, it's it's Lapo Berti's Nebbiolo Lange. Um, to give you a little bit more on that, 2016 vintage, superb vintage Nebbiolo. Italy's finest grape, responsible for Gattinara, Barbaresco. Barolo, Lessona, Gattinara, oof, it's fantastic, but it's just a great wine. Um, Lapo himself, Lapo's a winemaker, Ferenzo Boglietti, and when he bottles under his own label, he's he's got a he's got a tiny cantina. Well, he hasn't got a cantina. He operates in the corner of Enzo's cantina. He's just got a couple of barrels, um, and he makes. He's hoping to get up to ten thousand bottles one day. He's on about. 4,000 I suppose at the moment, not very many. Um, and he made I think a thousand bottles of this, maybe 1,200, not very many. Um, and the idea of the Nebbiolo is to make fresh, pure, precise interpretation of Nebbiolo. And honestly, he'd say he's done it beautifully, is putting it so, so mildly. This is magnificent wine. Um, my tasting notes were sort of blueberry, strawberry, touch of nutmeg. Um, had a lovely ripeness and purity of fruit. The tannins mature. There's none of that drying feeling in the mouth. It's absolutely ready for drinking. It's just a superb wine right now. Um, so yeah, buy it. And it would be, it was very good with a lentil shepherd's pipe, but it'd be very equally good with, with a nice bit of venison or a piece of cheese or whatever it is that you enjoy. Um, it's absolutely classic Nebbiolo. The link should be just underneath my face about now. Bye.